morning, y'all. Happy day five to the Upside Down Readathon. And happy Friday. Oh my God. <sighs> I did not go to bed until like two in the morning almost. Let's recap from last night because I did not end the vlog the way I wanted it to. Um, which I apologize. I feel like yesterday's vlog was not that fulfilling and I do apologize for that. Yesterday felt like one of those days where I just simply didn't feel like reading, which that's okay. We don't always have to be reading. You guys all want to know a fun fact about me. I hate school buses. I don't know what it is. The sight of them always sends me into like a sudden rage. I am having to take a little bit of a longer route to work because I'm not getting stuck behind a school bus because there's like 20 million kids that all live on my street. So not doing that. So I'm going the back way. Anyways, like I was saying with um, last night, yesterday was just one of those days where like I just really did not feel like reading. I didn't feel like picking up the book. So I listened to as much as I could. And I realized I didn't want to read. So I decided to start Stranger Things season four. I think I got the first four episodes in last night. I want to I wanna say that is correct. And I think I started season five by fell asleep <laughs> on the couch. So I need to restart that episode. So then as I was like, collecting myself I realized I have done zero editing for the vlog so I couldn't go to bed I had to go straight into my office and start editing so that's what I did I didn't go to bed until like 2 in the morning I think I can't even remember to be honest it's it was just a blur Saturday Saturday night ghost club I did read a portion of it I would say like 10% of it just really throwing that out there because I never really opened to the book. I just listened to the book while I was on my walk. And I'll be honest, I'm not really enjoying it. I, I think it's the writing style. Like I'm just, I feel like I'm also kind of confused and not really sure what's going on. So I may have to start the book over or I may just jump into my other book. I'm not really 100% sure how much reading I'll actually get done because after work today, my company is throwing a like a luau party type of situation. So after work, me and a coworker are going to be carpooling together, which will be so much fun. Um, yeah, of course I'll take you guys along with me. Let me know in the comments if you guys have been liking daily vlogging. I've been enjoying doing them. They are a lot of work. Like, I, I don't know how people do Vlogmas. It's gonna be a little bit before I do daily vlogging again. But I've been really enjoying it. I hope you guys are too. Um, I love seeing your comments and the thumbs ups and all the new subscribers that have came over. Like, thank you so much. Like, I love you guys. You guys are the best. Like, I'm like without words right now. Um, anyways, I'm going to go into work. I need a Polo Gwen bag. I feel like I have not been a, a chatty Kathy with her all day yesterday, so I feel so bad. Um, but yeah, I'm going to get to work, and then I will update you guys when I have more updates. Thank you. There you go. Have a good weekend. Um, can I get a venti iced pumpkin spice latte? Um, but can I actually do half pumpkin spice and half white mocha in the drink um that'd be it hello guys i just got off work i've kind of had this like tiny microscopic headache like all freaking day i had this like teeny tiny headache for like probably since this morning and i think it's because i've had lack of sleep so yeah <laughs> get your sleep in drink your water do things that i'm not doing um so yeah i'm actually meeting a co-worker because we have this work event to go to um, so I'm going to meet her, but I'm going to get coffee because I need it. Um, I, now that pumpkin spice lattes are back, I'm getting my favorite drink, which I think it's great hot or iced, but it is called the Cinderella latte. I don't know who created it, where it came from, where I found it, but it's 
Um, it is a pumpkin spice latte, but it's half pumpkin, or excuse me, it's half pumpkin spice and it's half white mocha. It is delicious. It's the best thing ever. Um, like I don't really like the pumpkin spice lattes, but like this one just like makes it so much better. It's like more chill and mellow, if that makes sense. Thank you. Have a great day. You too. Hello. So I am back home. Uh, I had this work event. I didn't take my camera because I left it in my car and me and a coworker rode together. So, but just got home. I am missing out on the live show, but I'm missing out on the live show happening on Kendall's channel. So I'm literally hopping on right now. Anyways, I got a really exciting package. So this is actually a birthday present to myself. I bought myself an iPad. So this is the case I got. It's just like a baby blue. I really don't like the feeling of this one, but I don't know. It was pretty cheap. So I bought that. And then I also bought like an Apple pencil. It's not like a real Apple pencil, but yeah. So this is my birthday present to myself. I got these paper feel screen protectors as well. And then this is the big boy that I've been waiting for. I'm gonna go ahead and open it. Oh my gosh. Here it is. I'm so freaking excited. The only colors they had available were like a space gray, but I think it's the same color as my um, MacBook. So no worries. I would have picked either the white or the rose gold one, but it's okay because it matches my MacBook. Ah, uh, so let's do an unboxing. Ah, uh, here it is. Ah, uh, I am so excited. Okay. Yeah, it does match my MacBook. So pretty. Okay, let's put it in the case before I drop it. I hope this is the right case, otherwise I'm going to be very upset. Okay, it does look like it's going to fit. Uh, it's so cute. Oh my gosh. Okay, we gotta turn it on. Where's the power button? Ah! So excited. Okay, we're gonna let that power on. Anyways, I am going to watch more of the live show. Maybe get a head start on editing this vlog so far. Um, kind of relax. Maybe watch some Stranger Things. Oh, I do need to give you guys a reading update. So, Unfortunately, I do think I'm going to DNF the Saturday Night Ghost Club just because I kind of really don't know how I feel about the book itself. The writing style is kind of different and honestly, I'm, it just doesn't excite me. So unfortunately, I am going to DNF it. I think I got to like page like 55 or something and unfortunately, I just wasn't just not feeling thrilled about it and I feel like I can fulfill that moment with something else. So I might start a new book later on tonight, might not, we'll see.